And from there, we move to Check Me Out, our weekly showcase of Nigerians doing amazing things around the world. This week, we check out Prince Namdi, AK, the e-commerce entrepreneur who is back home to bridge the gap between e-buyers and sellers in Nigeria. Business is war. You don't need people who will die for you. You need people who would fight for you because a dead soldier does not add value to the war. Hey guys, my name is Prince Namdi AK. I'm an entrepreneur and I'm the co-CEO of Conga. Come check me out. I went to a lot of schools. I was an above average student always in school. I was like a math geek. I used to go for a cowbell math competition. I used to do very well. Yeah, so I think that was my strong suit in, uh, in primary school. I traveled outside the country for my education. First, I went to Switzerland for two years before I went to the UK to do my university. So I studied economics and politics at the University of Lancaster for about three years um, before I left, I left the UK. And, but during my time in the UK, I also did a lot of odd jobs. So first, I, I was into music production at that point in time. So I, I used to make beats and sell them to, to my colleagues. I used to... I used to buy and sell products, so I had some sources from China that I used to buy headphones and different products and sell it in school. I also used to sell music production, production um, software in school just to, just to help me with my funding. My favorite music artist is David Doe. And not just because we went to the same secondary school, but I mean, he's a great artist. I mean, if you look at the guys in the industry today, they're really pushing the boundaries in what we call, um, in what we call Afro beats or, or African music. And I mean, what they're doing is really incredible. So when I moved back, um, I founded Udala after just a few months. And Udala was an omni-channel retail platform. So we had an e-commerce site, but we also had physical stores. Eventually, there was a merger between Udala and Conga to what we have today, the new Conga. She always give a story about one of our merchants who is in Balogu market. Um, she, when, when she started off on her platform, she was struggling. Um, she had one small shop, she had about three children. She was struggling to take her children through to school. But we were excited, I, I was very excited to hear a few months ago that this, this woman had three children now school outside the country. And she's expanded her operations to about four stores across the country. So I mean, such simple stories, they excite us because at the end of the day, what, what we're doing is we're connecting buyers and sellers and bringing them together. So, Whereas you just had a few customers in your store in Balogun were giving the access to the whole of Nigeria to sell your products. So I mean, the impact is, is quite huge. I'm definitely privileged. I mean, I, mean, I grew up from a good home. I, I studied outside the country. But um, I, I won't say that is enough to be successful in anything you do in life. I mean, one thing is to be privileged. Another thing is to have the work ethic and uh, have the mindset to succeed. I always tell people that success is where hard work meets, meets opportunity. So yeah, you can have the opportunity, but if you don't have the zeal and the mindset to fight through things you need to fight through, you'll never be successful. So guys, I'm Prince Namdi AK. I'm an entrepreneur. I'm the co-CEO of Conga, and you just check me out. Great advice there. Be ready when that opportunity comes knocking. Admirable, Prince AK. Now, let's take a quick reminder of our top story. Despite hosting the Ibom Power production plant, residents of Ipa Ibekwe community in Akwaibom State are seeking lasting solutions to blackouts. I don't have light. That is why I broke my leg. I cannot see my house again because of darkness. That's where we're wrapping up today's show. Don't forget, we want to hear your views. So join the conversation right now on Twitter at Just Nigeria TV. And for more on any of our stories, visit bbc.com forward slash Africa and channelstv.com. Thank you for staying with us. Until next time, I'm Ajake Olootse. Goodbye.